Hey folks, and welcome back to Writer's Bone on YouTube. I'm Daniel Ford. I'm Sean Technicolor Tui. Yeah. Look at that. Should we do black and white? Can we do black and white? I think we'd look sexy in black, black and white. And white. Uh, that'll be next week, kids. So it's been a while since we did we did a Dan and Sean watch TV. Uh, so we're doing it. Yeah. So Sean, tell the kids what we're watching. We're watching a classic. I almost forgot what we're watching. <laughs> <laughs> it's Batman. Batman the Animated Series from the mid-90s. After Tim Burton's two great movies uh, that don't hold up nowadays if you watch them. Uh, uh, I, would, I would make an Batman argument for Batman, Batman Returns, Returns, but yeah. yes, the first one does not hold up. The first one does not. But we're watching Batman the Animated Series. Uh, today's episode is POV. This is from Season 1, Episode 7. Uh, you can follow along, watch it yourself. We don't own the rights to this. We won't have to say that up front. Right. Uh, but we are going to do this auto-commentary. Watch it, have a good time with us, enjoy it. Um, and enjoy it when we get thrown in jail. Yeah. Yeah. For copyright. We'll have fun. Yeah. And that'll be a post. That'll be a has old ears. Yeah. Yeah. So. Bad publicity is good publicity. Any publicity is good publicity. Yeah. All right, um, folks. Uh, enjoy the show. Too much, Sean. Too much. Too much. Rolling credits, Sean. WB sign turns it into the great blip. I mean, this opening was originally used, I think we talked about it before, I'll say it again, was what the animators and the creators brought to, I think it, was, it must have been WB, and said, this is what the show's going to look like. And right. I mean, this short opening. It's a show in itself. Yeah. Yeah. I got to watch this all day long. Yeah. And the music. And which, we will. Yeah. Oh, no. This, <laughs> The music, which, you know, is based somewhat off Danny Elfman. Um, yeah. So it ties into, like, the original movies a little bit. Yeah. It has that same dark feel. Right. But this is, you know, the ultimate kind of Batman uh, portrayal. Because, look at it. I mean, yeah. it is. It, he's not wearing a bunch of armor. Yeah. Uh, he doesn't rely on a bunch of gadgets. Yeah. He's not in the car that much either. He's doing real yeah. detective. I was going to say, he's more of a detective in this show than, I think, even the movies. Yeah. Um, and he's kind of a badass. Yeah, because look, he's not wearing any armor. Right. In the show, in the movies, he wears armor. Episode title is POV. Such a good episode. Yeah. Uh, Sean Derrick and Lauren Brighton, which I like, they wrote for a bunch of other episodes. Uh, mm -hmm. This show and other TV, cartoon TV shows. Opening scene. It's more of a noir, if you think about it. What, this, this is the yeah, whole this, The whole show. Yeah, oh, yeah. I mean, look, the music. Just this dark look. Yeah. I mean, oh, Frank Miller's kind of uh, Sin City. Yeah, yeah. You know, or M, those kind of movies. Mm. Uh, Bullock. What a great character. Yeah, so good. I think they captured that in the new movies. Have, have you seen Gotham at all? The, no, no, I've not seen Gotham. I, I hear good things about that, too. Yeah. I'm spending a little time away from TV. Watching my, going back to my movies. <laughs> As we watch, watch TV, TV show. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, the cops pull up and they find a warehouse ablaze. Empty uh, Bullock. squad car. Empty sp Bullock squad car. Dun dun dun. I like there's a female uh, police officer too. Yeah. And she's carrying a gun that is huge. A shotgun, look at that. Oh, Why do they both have shotguns? They, <laughs> there's a fire <laughs> raging, <laughs> and they're like, you know what, instead of calling for a fire department... Let's blow some heads off. Yeah. Bullock, you so fat mess. Oh. I don't know, bad guys are crawling out a window. Use the shot. You were standing there watching them With use shotguns. the shotguns. Go alone, you rookie. Is Go Bullock, with the shotgun. Is Bullock not wearing a belt? I think that was big in the 90s. The kind of sans belt pants. Oh, yeah. I mean, I'm doing that now, but that's just out of laziness, I think, more than anything else. Batman makes his first appearance. Oh, uh, Bullock's pissed. Oh, and down he goes. Out. Or fade out. Fading in. Eating a candy bar. Hey, we get it. He's fat. Yeah, he's a big guy. <laughs> we, we go. Oh, he just knocked that, that candy was, that bar. Awesome. I take it back. Oh, I love Commissioner Gordon. Look at him. Yeah. Great job on this show. What happened to the two other guys? Oh, we killed them with uh, a few <laughs> money shot shotguns. Them. They were, it turned out actually they're two homeless men running in fear. 
pulled a shotgun on him, blew him apart. One said, I'm a Vietnam vet, please don't, I have a dog. And then he cut a shotgun shell to the mouth. You weren't me. You had a duty. All right, well, like, what's happening? Like I said, I had it going alone. Yeah, you did. Waiting for a whoops a month away when I saw that blasted bat in your head for the warehouse. Blasted. No one uses that as an adjective anymore. Yeah. So I followed you. It does seem dated. Revolver, fedora, yeah, a trench coat, oh. the bat. All of these, just like he's, you don't see Batman so far. We right. don't see him silhouette. Yep. I think throughout this episode, you see him in bits and pieces. Uh, what? How think about this? Is I think the fourth episode, no, seventh episode of the first season, right? And we're only seeing Batman in, yeah, you know, silhouette. He's not in a main part exactly. of his character. There are few TV shows that can get away with. Pulling their main character out for searches of the time, this yeah. is one of them. Yeah. And The and Wire the would be show. another. Yeah, oh, yeah. I agree. But look at this show. I mean, they spent time developing characters. Yeah. Like, if you think about Two Face in this episode, in this show, he starts as Hardy Deck. I yeah. think it's like five or eight episodes, or it's more, and he gets turned into. Yeah. Oh, die. Bullet falls. He's a, it's a mess. Excuse my gun, fellas. Oops. Of course. That's a big uh, handgun, by the way. Magnum. Right there. It's the fat, dirty, hairy. I love trench coat. I just love this whole scene. Bad guys just wearing dark clothes. And so is Bully. Ugly mug. Yeah, yeah, like ugly mug. Yeah. Bully with his... I swear to God, he's wearing blue sweatpants. He's taking <laughs> some ass right fighting. here, though. Yeah, he's fighting. Well, those blue sweatpants are helping him maneuver better. Uh, that would be an accident. I almost caught an axe to the face. <laughs> so we've established that he's a fat mess, yet he can uh, stop a axe attack. I think that's what's so great about the characters. They show him being this, like, hefty guy in yeah. a mess. But, like, he's actually a pretty good cop. Like, right. You know, he's he's got skills. He can yeah. handle himself. As we can see right now, he's fighting right. these two men. He just happens to be a scumbag. <laughs> yeah. But I, it's fine. I, but I also think that uh, when they, people meet him, they count it incorrectly. They don't, yeah. they don't see... Right. Big, tough, they see his tough minus eight. But he's a lot more. Yep. Everything with this fight is done in shadows. Yeah. Look at that. Places burning down. That that's what I miss about not even animated shows, but shows in general. Fights, any action is so fast. I, I want yeah. I want to enjoy it. I want to see someone getting the crap beat out of it. Not quickly, not slickly. Just how yeah. how it is halting in real life. Yeah. Did you ever see messy. They Live with no. uh, from nineteen eighty four with uh, Roddy Roddy Piper and so it's a, still no. It's a great movie, but there's a 13 minute fight sequence. Yeah, it's great. And it's literally these two characters beating the crap out. And it's not, like you said, where it's slick or fast. Right. It's literally like they drag themselves and they're like, <clears throat> like yeah. you hear them. Exactly. Right. Everything under control. And Batman showed up, I'm fucking everything. Yeah, Batman's the one who screwed up. Yeah. yeah. Look at that. I love that gray suit. The way that the cape falls, you know? Yeah. And then, yeah, this is the only kind of gadget he uses is yeah. a grappling gun. Yeah. Pretty much, yeah, the whole series. Yeah. Kind of like, like Batman screwed up, then saved my life. Yeah, you can't admit that, though. Yeah, right. <laughs> this guy's hair is awesome. He's got a mohawk, bald, got the rim going. Oh, yeah. Look at that quaff of hair <laughs> that he has, that uh, Commissioner Gordon has. It's so good. And that thick, bushy mustache. It looks like toothpaste spread over a toothbrush. Meaning <laughs> <laughs> this holiday donut. That's That's a, it's very festive. Yeah. It's big. I tell you what, it kind of looks like Bullock. His suit. <laughs> it looks like his sweatpants. Blue pants. Uh, go for the new guy. We weren't late. It looks like Ron Howard. We weren't late. We were just toting shotguns <laughs> to go to a fire. I accidentally shot a little girl riding a bicycle. I took her head clean off. I have nightmares about it. I love the way that shadows work in this show. 
Their eyes. Yeah. I have to say that their yeah. eyes, you know, like Disney movies, Disney movies, why the art was so good early on, but because their eyes. Yep. It's just drawn very well. Yeah. And it's not perfect. I mean, you can tell that the animation is not perfect, but that's what makes it so good. Yeah, there's some issues. But what they did with this, though, it, why it has that look is, you know, normally you draw on white paper, but they drew on black paper. Yeah. Uh, Batman throwing out some type of ninja stars? Uh, look like, uh, I know what they're called, but it's the black ball with, like, all the spikes. Spiky, yeah. Paper. That thing. Spiky balls. <laughs> I knew that in high school. And this whole episode is nothing but flashbacks. Yeah. The current, st the real storyline has no Batman. Yeah. And maybe, you know, they're depicting a town that doesn't know what to do with Batman quite yet, too. They don't know whether he's on their side. Yeah. I mean, I think Gordon does at this point, but... Unless we beat him. Yeah. <laughs> With our shotguns. I'll touch it. I hope you're as good at defending yourself. Since a detective here is calling you a liar. Wait a minute. Nobody's calling anyone. What, a, a male detective screwing a, a female uh, co worker over? That never happens. She looks well, like about to cry. Yeah. She's going to fuck something up. Great hair, Commissioner Gordon. Again, great hair. He spends half his morning just getting that ready. <laughs> you know what I like? Gordon, you can almost, like, his chin looks a lot like Batman's. If he was maybe, like, a shade younger, I think oh, the show yeah. could get away with, like, oh, is this Gordon and Batman? Huh? Is it? Well, no, I like that relationship, though, so much. I do, too. Batman. Yeah. Yeah, Frank Miller, um, who wrote uh, Long Halloween? I can't think of his name right now. Sam something. No, uh, J was it Jim Lowe? Yes, that wrote Jim, those? Jim yeah. Lowe and Tim something. Yeah, the, the crux of all of those is his relationship with Jim Gordon. Definitely. They're all great. It's kind of a, almost like a surrogate father. Yeah. He's almost more of a surrogate father to Bruce than Alfred uh, is. Alfred, yeah. They're two different, you know, they're... They're father figures, right? And, but in two different ways, right? You know, I want to say Alfred's a little bit more motherly because he's yeah. So yeah, supportive. that's a, that's a great way to put it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, she she's kind of enjoying this a little yeah. bit. Now, what do you think? Because people said that they that Batman is gay. Like he's well, not like oh, he's lame. But gay. Is <laughs> the actual meaning? <laughs> yeah, like he likes him. Yeah, like, I he, mean, like he enjoys meeting other men in, in bathroom stalls at airports. <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't know. I never, I never, Batman tapping his foot. <laughs> I, I never, I never quite got that. Uh, I always saw it as I don't think he has any sexual. I was going to say asexual, yeah. maybe, but not. Yeah. Because he's never shown anything that would say that. that would yeah. I think he's just asexual. Just like I don't think he had any care for it. Yeah. Story. I'm telling you, they were late. Commissioner, it's just not true. Bullock went in early. So you're accusing the detective of trying to haul up your trolley. Yeah. Great line, by the way. But we were not. It, all of this is is all yeah. strong. Now what, Commissioner? You're all suspended until I make my decision. Suspended. Great butt crack. Yeah, but no. <laughs> that was the most well-defined <laughs> animated butt crack ever. Thank God he's no bulges pants. though. They're, these guys have no bulges up front. <laughs> now they're putting the badges down. Oh, you gotta put the badge. Oh, they're, they're gone. Like, Where's the shotgun, son? Oh, Bullock's gotta be a dick. Yeah. You two are. Oh. In great she just spat something in Spanish. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you guys should probably not be using those guns, you're humongous. 
What office is this? Massive. <laughs> I know, it's huge. Airplane hangar. I love all the depiction of Gotham transportation. Yeah. It's always dirty, skeevy. He's starting to put it together. She, yeah, she's trying to, like a real detective, she's yeah. trying to sure. Gotham Harbor, the dock. Oh, it clicks. By the way, put her badge down, still wearing the uniform you know, jacket. Didn't with her the chair. Yeah. To change. She could have just easily gone into the locker room yep. and like changed into you know jeans. But she's like, no, I'll keep this up. Look at that boat. I mean, like, look, that's not great. But, <laughs> but it is what it is. It's yeah. just kind of schlumpy. She's wearing mom jeans, though. Yeah, she is, because those jeans do not flatter her. <laughs> she is top heavy, but they're not, they're not flattering her. No. I don't know why, I mean, why I'm sexualizing a cartoon. <laughs> uh, if you can't do that, Sean, then we, we need to fold the writer's book immediately. <laughs> Peering in the window. <coughs> Gasp! I was right. I got... And Wait, Batman, how did you get Batman? Batman's tied up. Batman's tied up. He's hanging from the ceiling in this dingy warehouse. And, uh... I, she, oh, I thought she got a... I don't know. I didn't know what was happening there. No, I just... There, she's reaching in her pocket, and then she pulled out a shiv. But she unlocks the door. She, she's going to be a... That was a... That was like an eight-second rubbing through her pocket thing. Yeah, they really spent the time. Sick bastard was drawing that. <laughs> Sir, I'm checking out this list of... Con oh. oh, it's his belt. Oh, I thought oh, it was... Oh, with the belt, yeah. Kevin Conroy doing the voice, man. This a classic, me. yeah. Oh, he's, he's out of it. Oh, speaking of Shiv, Batman pulls a knife out of nowhere. Which is great, because look, Batman is so smart, he knows that the only way you can get close to the boss, you won't be able to find him, but he could... Oh, jeez, he's knocking people out. But great he, animation. He, yeah, great animation. Screaming. Music in this fight. But he's like, the only way I can get close to this guy is if I allow myself to get caught. Oh, in the water. Drowning. I guess. You killed him, like, man. Like, Batman's like, I, I don't kill anybody. If they happen to die after I'm fighting them, well, hey. Did you ever see that college humor video? No. Oh, my God, I'll show it to you. Where it's, uh, the penguin is teaching Batman about death. Ha. I like it already. How broad is Batman's chest in this He's show? massive, but I mean, look, look at the guy. Like All he does is fight crime and work out. <laughs> True. That's why like, he's kind of like any act. Is this supposed to be Joker? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. He's got a, I think he has a monocle. Or he's got glasses. Is it, or is, oh, could it be Penguin? I, you know what? It might be. All right, so Batman and the female cop, Montoya, are... Squaring off against what six hoods? We and, just uh, ran out of the warehouse. Yeah. Batman just chucked a desk at this guy. Went through his skull. That guy is dead. Yeah, I mean yeah, that he's severely brain damaged. Why do people keep fighting Batman? Yeah. That's what I don't understand. <laughs> when you just hit a point where you're like, I totally get this. Yeah. I know that he, like, he's probably gonna hurt. Uh, so I'll go after the woman. This one hood yeah. who kicks his ass immediately. Batman doing a lot of throwing with his legs, which I like. Oh, that guy gets out of the legs. water just in time. Ooh. Tommy, Tommy Gunn misses Batman in the phone career. <laughs> Here you're alive! It's a horrible shot. Sorry, I just... I I'm nearsighted. I had a lot of coffee. I, lot of coffee. I, I don't know why they gave me the machine gun. Oh, Batman's... You know, asexual <laughs> or not, Batman's taking this female police officer home later. Oh. Oh, oh! What is one line? One line. <laughs> this guy has had not... what three lines in this whole show so yeah. far? Yeah, and they've all been kind of like quips. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's trying to get out of the water again. Oh yeah, so he's out of the water. He's angry. He's, he's, he's very up. angry. He's doing some dirty things to Batman. Oh, love the <laughs> love the eyes in the shadows. Yeah. <laughs> I have this little bit of string. I still have a desk attached to my head. But I also, just broke apart. Mantoya now knows no, she's going to crane. She's <laughs> massive crane. She knows how to use it all of a sudden. <laughs> you know, just like in her she bones. She had no like, training in it. <coughs> it still takes someone a couple tries to know how to like use a car. 
yeah. her son. But this massive She's train. gonna drop this on these guys, which won't hurt them at all. It'll no, just this stun them momentarily. <laughs> oh, okay. oh it drops right. attack. Oh, right. even better. And oh, the guy's going on. You know, like, imagine if they crush them, and Batman's like, What's wrong with you? <laughs> Oh my god, you poop! <laughs> oh my god, we have to hide this. We have to pretend that we're not here. Alright, so this hidden bad guy goes and makes a run for it aboard his ship, which is called the War. What is Something it? Ham? Something Ham. Or Ham. Or Ham. Did it just be Gotham? But I think it was a. Uh, yeah, it was Alright, now they're driving a forklift towards Batman. This guy is still wet, by the way. He's been out of the water for <laughs> a solid 25 minutes. Yeah. Drying, hair drying, and nothing. <laughs> also knows immediately how to use that uh, forklift. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it, gets crushed by those boxes. He's fine. He's totally fine. Those boxes didn't look heavy. Batman now driving the forklift <laughs> at speed to the boat. Oh man, does he? And he does. Oh, he jumps. Perfectly to the side of the boat. It's, it's, and it is now sinking. No, no. Oh, it's no, crashing, it's, it's it's crashing into the thing. Oh, that's worse, Batman. You know what you're going to do to this Gotham's economy? Now that the dock's been destroyed, they won't be able to bring in goods and services. This Jesus. Is what is it called? And, and the, the bad guy gets away. He's like, I'm fine. I'm good. I'm not shocked by He was thing. somewhere in the bottles of the ship, yet he was out immediately. I could run out of the way just as... He was scooped up by the, fork, uh, by the crane. Yeah, he did not make a run for it at all. So he, she brings him all the way up. Bannon's like, yes, good job. All right, I'm going to go. Gilmore Girls is on tonight. <laughs> makes a run for it. <laughs> My team was There we go. After a three-hour fight, backup shows up. Yeah, no one's dead. And they're all under arrest. Patty wagon. You and the Batman really turned this thing around. Yeah, what a car. You didn't just bust it. You put the whole gang out. Yeah. It's not like they're going to find you and try to take revenge. Yeah. Like murder yeah. your family. Oh. I think he just kicked his ass's, uh, kicked his boss's ass. Yeah. Gotta love the badge. No, it wasn't. You did it alone. No. Neither of these men were there to assist yeah, and you. Batman helped, sort of. Like, <laughs> smiling at the end of the episode. I'm surprised you didn't say something racist to her. <laughs> as it faded. Yeah. That was a, that Fantastic was it. episode. 21 minutes. Yeah. Of Clean, great. quick. Music's great. <coughs> story, I mean, the story is really good. Moved well. Yep. Um, it's amazing he's been around so long and he's been reinvented so many ways, but he still feels fresh. Definitely. And... and Let's we'll see, Bob Kane started in 1939, and uh, this came out in 1992. Yeah. And this was, again, just another iteration of him. At that point, the fourth or fifth. Right. You know, so. All right, well, another successful episode of uh, Dan and Sean Watch TV. TV yeah. What are we watching next, Sean? I don't know, folks. Maybe you should tell us if you go onto uh, Facebook, facebook.com slash writer's phone, or go tweet us to. Um, at Writer's Phone, and then tell us what we should watch and do some hashtag Dan and Sean watch. It's hashtag Dan and Sean watch. I like it. Tell us what we should watch next. Should it be Batman um, or should it be something else? Family yeah. Ties? So, Oh my god, we should totally watch I Family Ties. I haven't watched Family Ties in a long time. Don't Age better today. than I thought. I watched one episode the other night. Age better than I thought. Oh, alright. We'll have to watch that. The Jeffersons. There we go. Moving yeah. on up. We're moving on up. Green Acres. Nothing like two white guys commenting on a black show. <laughs> show. That <laughs> really redefined the generation, yeah. but that's fine. Yeah. But remember, if you go to at uh, Writer's Phone and do hashtag Sean and Watch, tell us what you think we should watch next, yeah. and we will. If we pick what you watch, you can win a prize. That's it. Remember, there we go. at Writer's Phone, tell us what we should watch. Hashtag Dan and Sean Watch. Yeah. We'll give you a prize. And instead of keep writing, keep watching, everyone. Oh!